feature about these is as you can see, they're mobile, so you can move them up and down the rack as you desire. A lot of other companies will just weld them directly to the construct, so you have no adjustability based on your body ergonomics. Some of our handle accessories, which we're known for, rotate handles, obviously sold in pairs. That was the uh, beginning where it all started. Kind of morphed into our spreader bar, and we have long bar, short bar. We have our rotate multi-grip family, which basically allows you to, with a simple locking device on the back of the handle you can lock the handle into four different grip positions on this model with that being said we from customer demand because people love this grip for pulling exercises it made sense and out of our customers requests and like i said demands we actually came up with an adjustable rotate pull-up station um, multiple width adjustments and it has a ball and socket design so it actually articulates with your, with your natural wrist angulation, no matter how wide or narrow you go. You can pronate and supinate through the range. So again, we're all about dexterity, mobility, vers uh, versatility. Walk around to the backside, there's actually two racks here. People are kind of glossing over that. So you actually have a half rack off the back of the HLP play loaded rack. This, these could be married together if you desired. So again, the whole Prodigy series is like an erector set. Single leg roller pad, another one of our popular attachments. Uh, Spotter arm stay home is pretty common. Um, and then we can move into the super squat bar. We've had a lot of people coming by trying this today. Everyone intrigued by the mobile back plate. Again, it's these small touches that can sometimes mean the most. So something not to gloss over. It's for upper cervical spine support. So again, it's one of those things. We wanted to create a bar that when you got in it, it was just well balanced and just naturally feels good. So that way you're focusing on the quads and the exercise and not worried about how you feel and comfortability of the actual bar itself. Very well balanced, we're getting rave reviews. A lot of people coming in, kind of doing the hey mile, look no hands approach, not even holding on to the bar. So it's pretty cool to watch uh, the customers do that. We've got our squat wedges here, brought both the old, the OG, the original, it's just the individual squat wedge. You can see here, and then we brought our solo wedges. Solo wedges came out after the fact for, again, more versatility. Heel elevation tool to obviously put you in a more quad dominant squat is the intent. Again, the call out here, obviously, convenient kickstand for loading and unloading of the weight plates. And then the major highlight is going to be the adjustable handle height. So you have multiple handle height options. It actually travels um, nine inches in terms of height adjustability based on how you position the bar and where you put the popper pin setting. And again, just very cool to kind of think of things outside the box, like mechanical drop sets. You can limit someone's depth range, um, etc. So pretty innovative. This is one of our newer releases that people have been really, really excited about. This is our shorty bench. Obviously, has to be short and back pad. A lot of really cool bells and whistles here. I call it kind of like the Swiss Army knife of benches. So as you can see, we've incorporated an elbow pad and a uh, dumbbell slash curl bar cradle for curl bar for curls, seated curls. Uh, these will actually can be removed and stored within the attachment. So now we went from curl bar to just a dumbbell setup, which is pretty cool. If you want to get the height of a standard adjustable bench with a simple proper pin adjustment, I can then lock in the head pad. So now I just turn that into a standard bench. Uh, we have a deep line ankle pad here. Again, the system always the same. That proper pin, you can pop in your deep line pad. Uh, so very, very versatile. Uh, again, just we always are trying to take kind of these common run-of-the-mill products and just push the envelope and assign forward approach.